Hello and welcome. Today we are going to be talking about biological nitrogen fixation by legumes. To begin, you must first understand the importance of nitrogen in plant growth. Nitrogen, or N2, is a critical limiting nutrient in both natural and agricultural systems. Nitrogen makes up 78% of the Earth's atmosphere. But unfortunately, this form of nitrogen is not available to plants. Often nitrogen in the soil is provided through the Haber-Bosch process, a chemical process that converts nitrogen from the atmosphere along with hydrogen into ammonia that is then implemented into the fertilizer that is used on agricultural fields. However, this is not the only way for plants to obtain nitrogen from the soil. This is where biological nitrogen fixation, or BNF, comes into play. BNF was first discovered in 1901 by Martinus Bijernik, a Dutch microbiologist. It is the method in which nitrogen gas from the atmosphere is fixed to the plant tissue via diazotrophic bacteria. Legumes such as beans and peas have a symbiotic relationship with the diazotrophic bacteria rhizobia, though only 20% of legumes are known to fix nitrogen. In this relationship, the roots of the legume plant provide a home for the rhizobia. For legumes, the rhizobia convert N2 from the atmosphere into ammonia. In this process, the legumes release flavonoids from their roots that call the soil bacteria towards the root hairs of the legume plant. Next, the rhizobia move towards the root hairs and begin to attach. Once attached, the root hair then begins to curl around the rhizobia and trap it within the root hair. At this point, the bacteria is then able to move down the root and create an infection thread that forms the final nodule that contain the bacteria. Once the nodule is created, the bacteria are able to use an enzyme called nitrogenase to break down the N2 into ammonia. This requires energy from the plant in the form of ATP to combine with the nitrogen and hydrogen to form the ammonia. It takes 16 ATPs, which is a very intensive process for the legume plant. This is why the legume plant would much rather fix nitrogen from nitrate and ammonia in the soil. Once the N2 has been converted to a more available form, the legumes can then use the ammonia to synthesize proteins for growth and photosynthesis. Biological nitrogen fixation is extremely important to plant growth as soil bacteria in the soil fix about 25 to 90 percent of the total legume nitrogen. Hope you enjoyed this talk. Thanks for listening.